What we are going to discuss today is the Square ecosystem and how we use it in the framework of Kiva. And there's a lot of um, there's a lot of um, options out there that I've heard over the last you know couple of days and that we've worked with over the years. One of the options of uh, is Bento Box, so we've heard a lot about that. And the one thing about um, what makes the Square system so powerful is that um, Square has a huge growth initiative towards the small and medium-sized growth business. And um, Square is actually run by Jack Dorsey, who um, was the ex-CEO of Twitter. Um, and they've done an incredible job uh, in integrating all of the payment, point of sale, invoicing, accounting, uh, loyalty, marketing, web, app, all into one massive umbrella. And if you were to add all of the services that we could potentially use by partnering with external platforms, Square saves us around with the number of stores at least that we have uh, between twenty and thirty thousand dollars a year in other integrations. And so, um, a lot of integrations, you know, they they want to integrate with Square to have, for example, an app. But Square already has partnered with Get Order to, to do that technology already. Um, you know, other companies can do marketing, but Square has it integrated, so it's a seamless transition between um, the customer and the business. So we're going to go through some things here and talk about what makes uh, the platform uh, incredible. And so the first thing I'm going to go through, um, you know, obviously uh, the reporting system that we have. Um, you know, if we if we look at um, the month of April, uh, we can get really granular from a cloud-based standpoint on um, how we do uh, from a sales to categories uh, to conversions. Um, all of our uh, loss prevention um, is is within this framework. So, um, but what we want to talk about uh, the marketing side of it. If I go to Square Marketing, uh, we have an incredible. Uh, we have text be text message based marketing. We have email marketing. We have receipt based marketing. All of those things are um, already built into Square. And the neat thing about the API is that the the marketing um, API is that um, it allows us to really uh, understand. Like if I go to email here, what campaigns that I'm running and whether or not those campaigns are successful or not. Um, so when I go to my into my overview, um, it'll tell me uh, the different based on the different campaigns between March 29th and uh, April 28th, we've generated about six thousand five hundred dollars in sales, um, and we've got all of our our text messages and things like that. <clears throat> um, our loyalty system is incredible, all um, through the Square uh, ecosystem. Uh, let me see here. So we'll go through here. But what we want to do is we want to get into um, we want to get into the online aspect of Square. Here's one that I like too. Um, the more you do, uh, Square will issue you um, lines of credit that, based on your your actual usage, um, that you can actually use to um, grow your sales. Um, so that's pretty good. So uh, I could get up to three hundred and sixty-seven thousand dollars. And open uh, new stores if I want to, but let's go into the online portal. Um, if you look at our website, um, www.kiva.com, um, we can go through here, um, and you can take a look at our website. And the internet's always running, uh, always running slow. Uh, obviously, mo mobile optimized. Uh, so seventy percent of our users users actually go to the smartphone. Um, so. Uh, Square makes it um, really, really simple to. Oh, look, there's the Karen smoothie. Uh, Square makes it very, very simple uh, for online ordering. Um, everything about our website is designed and geared around um, ordering online and um, choosing items and modifiers. And uh, if if we want to, uh, the nice thing about this, and we'll go ahead and choose a 24 ounce smoothie. With Skinny, I can add the order to my shopping cart, 
Um, and then if I decide I wanna, I can, I can pick it up in Carson City or I can have that item delivered. And the neat thing about this is that the online ordering and the delivery is all built into the Square ecosystem. Um, so how does Square do this? Well, one thing is uh, Square has partnered uh, with Weebly um, Square bought Weebly, which is very simple to, to like a Shopify or a WordPress to, to integrate uh, both the web and the e-commerce platform under one umbrella. And the, one of the main reasons why um, I like it is uh, because I'm, I'm, a, I'm a, uh, a WordPress guy by trade. I mean, I've used WordPress for years and it's fantastic in a lot of modules. But the problem with WordPress is you're constantly updating the modules. If you're not on top of it, the, the website will inevitably crash. Um, and Square, there's really no charge uh, to, to do a Square website. Um, there's a few advanced features that you can pay for, but it's very, very um, inexpensive. And so um, Square controls all of my search engine um, optimization, all built into Square. Um, it has all of your um, site preferences. Um, oh, that's not going to do it there. Um, if I want to go to, uh, let's see, let's go down here, website. Uh, I want to go to fulfillment settings for pickup and delivery. Um, Square allows you to do your own delivery, allows you to do your own pickup. You can control virtually every aspect of the customer experience from any of your locations. So if I click on Carson City, for example, I can decide um, the terms and conditions on how I want delivery to happen. I can, I can set delays. I can uh, charge customers for delivery. So um, I only pay $2 if a customer does delivery. So I can choose if I want to, to push all the cost of delivery onto our customers um, all within the Square and Weebly um, API. Um, going into the uh, going into the website, uh, let's go in here. We'll go to Edit Site, so you can see how that works. And so, boom, there's our site. So basically, really simple. We have our main banner, um, which I can change the image. So if I want to replace that image, I can replace it with a number of stock photos that um, I've created in the banner. Again, very um, very simple platform. If I want to change the overall theme of the website, um, the layout, the color, uh, I can change almost anything just with a few clicks of the mouse. Um, where is the content creator? Uh, I think that's just the main page here. Oh, site design right here. So on the bottom under site design, um, I can choose virtually any theme that I want, and I don't want to change it. Oh, let's go ahead and change this one. So if I want to, I can change it based on the season, however um, however I want to do it. Since we're promoting our cold-pressed juices, um, I just leave my theme the same. Um, in terms of flexibility, you have uh, virtually uh, unlimited uh, options. So there's your, your jobs, for example. If I want to go to my application, um, I've added my own uh, HTML code. So this is code that I did uh, through a web form uh, to do like a job application. So there's a lot of customization uh, options there. Um, and there's just also tons of different templates and designs and all sorts of things that we can do. Um, in this 11 seven days, my actually web traffic dropped um, because the week reset. But um, if I look at it on a week over week basis, um, there's six, some weeks where we'll have 10,000 people view our uh, uh, come to our store or come to our website. Um, and you know we had seven you know 7,700 unique visitors. Um, I can control my online orders so I can see um, who's ordering online. So if I go here, Oh it's, oh, it's report. Oh, there it is right there. So these shows you all the online orders right now that are happening in our stores. Um, if I go to reports, uh, I want to go to online sales. I can say, okay, well, who's ordering online? Um, you can see uh, my conversion rate, 3.56%. Uh, 
um, your average order ticket, which is significantly higher than uh, than when they order in our store. So our average ticket in our store is about twelve dollars. If they order online, it's uh, sixteen dollars. So that's cool. Uh, I can do um, coupons if I want to do a coupon. Um, I can do, and I can do. Uh, I could do different marketings, pop-ups, everything. And it's all integrated in the point of sale system. So what happens is when a customer orders online, it prints right on the register immediately. Um, and we can do things like curbside delivery. Uh, it, it's, it's infinite in terms of the possibilities. But what, what's most important is third-party integrators cannot integrate coupons into the square code, you have to do that manually. Loyal, they can't do loyalty. That can only be done through the square um, API through Weebly. Um, so then on top of that, um, Square uh, made uh, an agreement with Orta. So Orta, uh, the guys that owns it, his name is Roy. Um, Orta uh, is an integration uh, for the Square app. And so basically what that means is any change that I make to my inventory system, to my item library, to my stores, any change that I make is instantly up. I shouldn't say instantly, but very quickly is updated um, within the Kiva Juice app. Um, you can check out our app right now by downloading it on the App Store or Google Play on Kiva.com. But the simplicity of it is... Um, I can choose what locations that I want to enable on the app. I, I can choose different themes, different colors. Um, I have full control over the catalog of items um, that are for sale on the app. Um, it integrates with uh, it integrates with Instagram, delivery, DoorDash. I can do Jennifer Thomas. I can do um, I can do any type of integration that you could possibly want with within the realms of um, of the App Store. Uh, I can I can do. I think we have a welcome screen here. So when I go to welcome, so I have a cool welcome screen when they download um, you know, the web ordering. We already do that. Uh, I have the smart app banner. Um, the smart app banner is when they go to the website and you see the little banner on the top. Um, so uh, everything and the thing about the the app, the thing about the app is that only 15% of your most diehard customers will ever download the app. And this is just another example, another way of um, of uh, supporting uh, those customers. So if I look at, um, I don't know if I could do custom reports, but if I look at just this year alone, um, how many people have downloaded our app? Uh, let me see here. Oh, that's weekly. I want to see. Oh, you can only really see it monthly. All right. Well, that sucks. Um, so uh, let me see if I can change the. You used to be able to see the all time uh, downloads. So let me see if I go here on the reporting and I go to uh, through December. Oh, there's February. Um, yeah, period monthly. Yeah, so we've had uh, 4,400 people download the app. Um, and then also order is also going to do the kiosk. So the kiosk we can download. It's basically a simple design template um, that we can integrate uh, into uh, the um, into the store. So you know, we, we choose the template, we can design our own, um, and they go ahead and, and process it. Um, but this literally, uh, we just need to upload the image. And uh, Orta will also do the kiosk for us um, that I sent the information to. I don't know what that is. Growth tools. Uh, oh, that's, that's new. Uh, let me see here. So what's this one say? Uh, oh, that's cool. So I did this one. Coupon discount. So... Um, I forgot that I did that. So, um, so anyway, um, you know, all of our QuickBooks integration is through Square. Um, our Google Analytics um, is also linked to Square and the um, the Kiva.com API. So, 
um, through both of them, um, we can get really granular in terms of like who our customer is, the, the ages, <clears throat> um, where our customers are coming from. Um, so like I can see in the United States right now, uh, what day is this? Yeah, so last month, uh, the majority of people um, came from the United States. But if I wanted to get granular, and this is all Kiva.com data, um, you can see 33% of my customers are from California and about 4% are from New Mexico. And I can even get more granular to really find out um, where our customers are coming from. So that's cool. Google Ads is another story. Um, I target a lot of our competition. Uh, number one ad click is uh, our Jamba Juice, which is our competitors. We can talk about that. Um, but all in all, it's an incredible ecosystem. <clears throat> what we So it doesn't take me that long to update it. And our website is simple and it serves one purpose, which is to drive traffic to our stores and to generate revenue. Um, I've attempted to tell a story and have blogs and things like that, but our customers, they want to buy stuff. Um, you know, I would also say like, there are a couple other location pages that we have, uh, Club Kiva. So there's our loyalty program. I did this cool little thing with HTML, little drop down, so that's kind of neat. Um, our gift card campaign is all on there for digital gift cards. It's all linked. And then, um, but, 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 but what else? So where's the other one here? Uh, Square, oh, here. There it is right there. Uh, e gift cards, our menu, <clears throat> which is in a digital format, jobs, FAQs, stories is kind of like a blog. Um, and then our secret menu. So we have a secret menu, which is cool. So anyway, let me know your thoughts. Uh, but that's a breakdown of how we integrate uh, Square into pretty much everything. So um, let me know. Thank you.